I think this is the fourth time that we've um, put out sandbags, this year and last, and then in 97. And we put some bags out in, uh, I forget it was 98 or 99, there was a flood, but the water didn't quite get to the bags. Back in 97, after that, that record flood, um, the previous record flood, the uh, city engineer uh, drew a line on the map and said, well, from this line down, everything at lower elevations is eligible for uh, buyout, it's voluntary. And we did receive a couple of letters in the mail, which we filed because we didn't see the need or have the interest in selling. The disruption and the expense, it just didn't seem necessary. And I think uh, time has borne that out. We're, we're quite well placed here. And it's a nice location and it, uh, you know, we have uh, big mature trees and we're within sight of the river even in the summer when the trees are leafed out. Uh, we're just a 10 minute walk from downtown Fargo put a lot of work into this. The house is just a, a basic uh, a craftsman style two-story uh, house that I forget the footage, 1,400, uh, 40,000 square feet. Um, but we've replaced the garage, added a room above it, bumped out the front where the porch was, bumped out the west side, uh, restored all the woodwork back to the original style. Uh, we put a lot of work into it, and it's, it's not just a piece of real estate to us, uh, something that you just cash in on. It's, it's where we live, and we uh, hope to live here for a very long time.